ready to new game! Saving the load, saving the load. Settings? Settings? Don't quit strong bad gaming. Scenes from the next episode. Hi everybody, this is Son of the Hunter Mackinen, and welcome to, uh, welcome back to Strong Bad School Game for Attractive People. It's time for Episode 3, Baddest of the Bands, and I've been drawing this a little bit because, of course, you might remember this game, or this episode specifically, made my bottom five uh, adventure games list. Uh, Strong Bad School Game for Attractive People uh, as a whole, actually made my top 10 adventure games uh, list a long time ago. And, okay, so uh, I, I say I've been dreading it, I'm, I'm joking a little bit. But this is the episode which I had the biggest expectations for, and I think that's part of the reason why I was so disappointed with it, uh, more so than anything else in the game. Uh, because, uh, as I mentioned in that bottom five video, uh, the Homestar Runner cartoon is so well known for having very, very good musical parodies. And so, unfortunately, this game just did not offer anything on the level of the actual cartoon. So, uh, to be fair, I, maybe I put it up um, on a too high of a pedestal. My expectations for it were a little too high when I started it out. Um, but anyway... Uh, like I mentioned in the video itself, like, it's not that I don't think there's anything good about this game. I mean, I think there are some really good, uh, funny jokes in it. But, um, I think puzzle-wise, this one is not one of my favorites. And, like I said, there's not a lot of good music, there's not a lot of, like, new good music in it. I, there's not even a lot of, like, recycled music like there was in the first two episodes, which was kind of surprising. And I apologize ahead of time, I might have to actually cut out some of the music... Uh, when I edit the final video, but I think most of it is on YouTube anyway, so if you really want to hear it, you can. Okay. And let's start this shindig. I get that big opening speech just because I've had a hard time in the past All right, Sonor, fun machine. talking let's over the dialogue. For me today. Because I just enjoy playing this so much. Hot Babely and Odyssey, loosely based on the life and times of the coolest rock band in the world, Limousine! Okay, hot Bablians, get ready to be rescued and romanced by my rock and roll rulage. Okay. Okay, so now we're finally playing the fun machine like uh, I haven't been doing in the previous episodes. Hey, what was that? No. As you can see, it, it kind of looks like an Atari uh, no, no, no. 2600, uh, no. but the controller is definitely like Come an NES on, controller. Man. Oh, and Mike Semley is back again. Scrap. He's one of the Monkey Island writers. Oh, I like that. Crap cakes. Not again. I just sprayed three cans of 4WDD in the cartridge slot this morning. Looks like I'll have to take it to the only fully licensed vid electrician in town. Oh, yeah, because Bums. Video Electrics is the company Don't that makes the fun machine. broken fun machine. Bobs will fix you up better than new. And let's take the All metal right, detector. The tarantula black metal detector. Now with built-in shovel attachment. Now that's re just repeating the previous. Uh, what what he said in the previous episode. Uh, but uh, I think in the in the fifth episode, actually, he says he says something else. Uh, let's go outside just to check. I don't think there's anything here, but. Nothing new here. Okay, well I guess we'll just go to Bubs. Ooh, gotta start a fresh map since the King of Town inherited <coughs> my old one. Let's find a place for Bubs place. Okay, I put Pubs is up here last time. But I think it's it makes more sense to put it down here. This map gets completely reset halfway through the game anyway. I do actually think this first half is still pretty good. Bubs, you gotta help me! It's my fun machine! It's broken! It is? Well, we can fix that no problem! Oh, good. I was afraid that that'll be one big sack of cash! One big sack of what? One big sack of cash! 
This is gonna be a tricky job. I gotta order some parts, hire some skilled labor, go back to night school, maybe take some tap lessons. How am I gonna get a big sack of cash? You could get a job. I sure could use an apprentice grime taster. No, there has to be a more convoluted way. But how? Rock and roll so bad! That's it! I'll put on a battle royale yeah. of the <laughs> and use the profits to fix my fun machine. I know all about putting on concerts, Strong Bad. I'll even help you out. You will? Sure, I love little side projects. I'm knitting a winter vest with my feet right now. See? <laughs> Terrifying. So, who should I get for my battle royale of the bands? Slow down there, strong band. Before you start signing up any acts, you're gonna need two things. Security and celebrity judges. Boring. Without celebrity judges, no one's gonna bother to come see the kind of fourth-rate acts that'll pay to be in a contest. And without someone running security, who'll monitor the line to the cold one stand? The mist tent? The porta potties? Who the crap wants that job? I don't know, man. But while you were staring at my feet, I made you this deluxe security jacket. All right, so Get we. Get some poor sap to wear this thing and find me some celebrity judges. That will be an illegitimate business. All right. Oh, here's a stencil. We need that. This must be what Bubs used to make that lame security jacket. Hey, what's this? Some kind of old contest entry for? Ooh, they actually hit, use Win the Iron Maiden font. Rip rock debut with Limousine's album cover design contest. If you've got a photo that you think is tough enough, simply scribble your name and address on the back, slap on a stamp, and send it to blah 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 blah. If your photo is chosen, you get to spend a whole day with Limousine for your Rip Roar and Rock Devoo! Whoa, an entire day with Limousine at my call and back! That would be so tremendously awesome that it kind of hurts my brain and I maybe need some aspirin! Oh yeah, so Limousine does make an appearance in this episode. Sort of. Uh, and you can see... What the crap? Someone's been vandalizing Strong Badia's precious natural resources. All right, so Tarantula, that's kind of like the, uh, I don't know, is it kind of like the Metallica of the Strong Bad universe? Sloshy is like a indie band, then there's Limousine. Duo Duo, we'll find out who that is, and there's Cool Tapes, that's Marzipan's band. The Strong Badia flag is flying at half-mast until the fun machine returns to full-mast. All right, so, uh, uh, so we need to sucker someone into uh, being security for us. Uh, we also need, uh, uh, yeah, and then we need to take that photograph. Oh, there's a bunch of uh, there's. A, we finally get to st strong. We finally get into Strong Mad's room in this episode, which is kind of uh, fun. Um, and then I think they're showing like a rocket documentary on TV. I'm just taking down here so I don't miss any inventory. Uh, yeah, and I kind of do do miss, uh, regret that we haven't played the fun machine before. I keep the rotting corpse of Charlemagne around in the hopes that he'll one day rise from the grave. Check here. What's this? Ah, I must light. have left my lighter here during last night's candlelight Spemales After Dark session. Mm -hmm. All right. Ah, there it is. <laughs> oh, look at the poster. I, I tried to click stupid straight. British dudes that I thought were ugly British chicks. Hey there, Sister Christian. Remarkably, I don't have time for you today, Strong Bad. I'm sure I'll instantly regret asking this, but, uh, what you doing? I've finally decided to pursue my dream of becoming a snooty rock and roll journalist. A rock and roll journal? 
You won't be bwah ha ha after I've sold the poignant coming-of-age tale of my snooty exploits to a snooty independent movie studio. You're right. I, I shouldn't... <laughs> you don't know anything about a bat infestation, do you, Count Succula? Ah, I see you've met the Von Blaubloods. The Von what? The Von Blaubloods. A rich lineage of fruit bats I'm raising in my bat hutch. I don't care how cool their last name is. Tell them to stay out of my room. Well, the bile in my throat tells me it's time to stop talking to you. I've got a fun machine to get repaired. All right. Okay, let's see if we can take the camera. What's that? That's my Totalmatic Sudden Shot camera. It's so obsolete that it actually uses a mysterious substance known as film to make pictures. Whoa, exotic. Can I borrow it? No way, Strong Bad. Okay, so we do have to do the security uh, puzzle first. Hollering Jimmy's bat hutch kit? Since when do you keep bats in your room? Not just any bats. The Von Blaubloods are an extended family of majestic fruit bats. They inspire me. To what? Get rabies? Can I borrow your awesome bat hutch? I uh, want to do that thing with the tinfoil that screws up their sonar. You leave the Von Blaubloods alone. All right, yeah, we okay, have to get okay, Strong Sad geez. out of the way. Don't foam at the mouth. Okay, we need a spray bottle. Uh, there's the sword. Do we need? Hey, this? how'd you get your fake dress-up sword out of Pom Pomerania? Or Club Techno Chocolate? That, my friend, is a tale fraught with intrigue, drama, and mild adventure. It all started. Yeah, and... yeah, stop talking. Can I borrow it? No. All right, so we finally have somebody stopping us. So I do have to give the game a little bit of credit credit here. Ooh, old record. Whoa, there's something I haven't seen in, like, forever. Strong Sad cried for days when I defaced this record into the most awesome album cover idea ever. I bet you could sell, like, a kajillion records if you put together an album cover like this. All right, so this is the album cover we need to, to take a photo of. Uh. Ooh. Come on in here. Man, that painting is creepy. And strong, mad stuffed dinosaur, Pudonkus. Hey, Muscles, mind if I borrow this? Pudonkus! Guess so. Strong Mad plays a heavy bass. Literally. The strings are actually those cables they use to hold up bridges. Hey, little man. Where's my pick? What's new in your monosyllabic world? Cool types. Oh, band practice, huh? Have you kicked Marzipan out yet? She brings snacks. Fair enough. Well, this has been fascinating and articulate, but okay. I got a fun machine to repair. See you later, S-Mad. I think we... Okay, yeah, that's what I thought. You had to talk to Strong Mad to Band get Marzipan's house. Marzipan's is always good for a little heckling, but where should I put her house? Let's put it in the corner. All right, because this actually gives us a clue. Hmm, Zen Rock, do we need this? Carefully arranging this rock in my pants will enhance my overall serenity. And now I think Strong Mad is here. Yikes, that is one pathetic looking bat. For your information, Strong Bad, that is Pasquil, an endangered and precious Lithuanian albino vegan bat. Marzipan! Take five, everyone. What is it, Strong Oh, yeah, that's another thing. Stro Marzipan can somehow play the guitar with no hands. <laughs> what are you guys practicing for? The Cool Tapes have been invited to perform at a concert to benefit the endangered Lithuanian albino vegan bat. Like uh, that's something that we well have to take there. care of at some point. Yuck, yuck. 
Stay on cool. You know it. All right. I didn't want to go to the to those all of those different locations yet. But I think we have to uh because there's a bunch of stuff there we need. I think the stick has like the star. No, it doesn't. Oh, there. This is science. Eat at Bob's. Do I have to? Can I just take Bob's this? doesn't need this light and star. Why does he waste money on advertising when he's the only game in town? And he's right over there. Okay, very good. Wait, did the Blubbos turn around? Let's see what sort of gibberish the old drive through whale is spouting today. I'm a pretty girl. Well, that was unexpected. Yep. Blubbos is always kind of weird. <laughs> Alright, but here's the cup now. Uh, here's the car. Ooh, yes. All right. And I think this is the eternally burning oil. We need to stick this on the... One fish, two fish, starfish, carfish. And we need the Boudonkis toy. I think I like you, glowy starfish. You do not make me want to barfish. Okay. But... Oh, 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 I know where it is. Okay. Duh. Okay, but now that Strong Mad's gone, I can actually go get. I think I can go get Budunkus now. I couldn't before. But I think the thing we need is in the refrigerator, actually. I just haven't looked for it yet. Oh! Wait! Strong Side's gone. I can steal With the camera. With the automatic sudden shot at my side, I'll totally be able to shoot all sorts of automatic pictures. Suddenly! Okay, this was easier. I I thought we actually had to do the strong sap puzzle first. In my pants. Hope I don't get bit. And I can take the fake sure sword as well. Which is duller, my brother or his padded safety sword? Let's call it a tie. All right. And then let's take Pudonkis. Ah, the mighty Pudonkis. His natural camouflage made him virtually invisible to predators in his native environment, which was, apparently, a clown's house. <laughs> uh, that's another thing. It was also in the previous episode. Uh, 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 Strong Bad has to close the... Uh, has to close the uh, door For every the time magic he leaves. Of force perspective, the unsuspecting automobile is threatened. Oh, by I the forgot. Long thought extinct. Giant Pudonkis. Oh, but I forgot to check the refrigerator. Okay. So let's go in and get that. Aerosol cheese. Wait. A can of Wallapino flavored aerosol cheese. Easily one of my top five foamy orange food products ever. Okay. And now that we have the bats, uh, because they're trying to, because Marzipan's band is trying to uh, arrange a concert for the endangered bats, what we'll do. Oh, wait, do we need. Hmm. Or does it, does it work? Bats in the dryer? That'd be cruel, inhumane, and not nearly as funny as putting them in the washer. I clicked the washer by accident. Okay, uh... Dryer. Here's the washer. Washing up strong, sad bats. Maybe someday I should wash my pants. Hmm. Clean bats. Guess I should have expected that. Oh no, we need bleach. That's the thing that we're missing. Okay, we can't do that puzzle yet. But no matter. We can go to Strong Badia. We have now we have the stencil and a spray can, so we can actually use it use it on the fence. Wow. It seems like a good place for a stencil. We use the uh, spray cheese. Now that's a spicy bit of graffiti. 
Excuse me, is this the fabled fence where all the hipsters vandalize public property with the names of their favorite bands? Why, yes. Yes, it is. Oh, good. I'm a snooty rock journalist looking for the next big thing to be pretentious about. Do tell. Security. Hmm. All right, and now we give him the jacket. Check out this article of clothing. What is it? It's a security jacket. You know, the kind worn by security guards. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. You can't fool me. Huh? You don't think I'm cool enough to be a fan of that cool new security band that everyone's talking okay. and about? <laughs> I thought I missed that uh, up. <laughs> yeah, that's it exactly. Where'd you get that jacket? I have to have one. Yeah, good luck with that. These babies were snatched up by all the hipsters weeks ago. Oh. I guess I could let you borrow mine for a while. Really? As long as you promise not to get any failure on it. I promise. I won't fail you. Hip Indy Credville, here I come. <laughs> How do I look? Like a guy who's totally tapped into today's underground music scene. I'm gonna show this off to everybody. Yeah, you do that. Ah, he's security humming to slushies. We don't even that care what about they call you. Fans of security? Interesting. Well, hello yourself, security guy. No, dummy. That's what I call dummies who've signed up to run security at Strong Bad's Battle of the Bands. But, but you're wearing my security jacket, ain't you? Yes, but so take this billy club and get securitizing. Okay. All right, we we solved that puzzle. We'll get the second half of this opening stuff done in the next episode of Strong Bad's Cool King for Attractive People. See you then. Bye.